Greetings once again, Dragon Guardians. Dues biz then back again with more of the Dragon Prince, Mystery of Aravul. Last time it was the escape from Umbertor. As Team Zim was desperate to find the resting place of Aravos, or the seal of the resting place of Aravos, whatever you want to call it, Rex Igneous was having none of it having been at odds with Zim's parentage. Luckily, before everyone could get uh, really acquainted huh, why he's called Igneous, Zubea showed up to put that dragon in his place. And naturally not wanting to step to the dragon queen, Rex Igneous backed off. Meanwhile, Janai squares off against Karim to see who would lead the Sunfire L. The full extent of Karim's machinations came to light and he was arrested. But the question remains, is this truly the end of the infighting of the Sunfire L and those who would try to challenge Janai's right to the throne, given the current state of their people. And then there's Claudia and Viren. Claudia, having managed to get a copy of the map, finds that her freshly resurrected father Viren is now possessed by Aravo. And what exactly this means? Well, means it's only a matter of time before Aravos is free. What'll happen next in this new Book of the Ocean? Join me as I find out, won't you? Oh, that looks like a giant clamshell. Oh, Zubaya. Oh, we're here, at the ocean. Ooh, dark and stormy. <laughs> Don't fall. It would kind of suck if your mission came to an end right here and now. What the heck is that? Just a platform? Huh, interesting. I feel like we already com completed a mission here. Is this some kind of lighthouse? Oh, ooh, glowy. Very glowy. Is this a you might want to back away situation? Oh, whoa. Okay, that is a hell of a beacon. Mysteries of our ovals. I always want to say mysteries plural, but it's just mystery. Book 5, Ocean. Chapter 1, Domina Profundus. Sounds like a spell. Domina Profundus. Oh, all right. <laughs> the people you love are literally currency. Yeah, there must be some way of getting them out. I kind of hope they can't hear you. Because any consciousness inside of those coins? Oof. No, thank you. <sighs> oh, uh, holding portal. Wait, why hide that from him? Come on! If anything, he might actually be able to help you find a way of freeing them. Tell him the truth. Oh god. Ask a dumb question, get a very wordy answer from a nerd. It's very poetic. <sighs> yep, Claudia and Virian. How do you kill a star touch elf? Or, at the very least, re-imprison him. I mean, those coin thingies seem pretty powerful. Okay, two steps forward and moving nowhere. See if the cast out? Yeah, move how? Uh, he's not gonna feel anything. Oh, his sickness is back. Because he uses magic, is happening all over again. Hmm, are they back at the palace? Oh, Erebus. Oh, whoa, well, what's going on? Did something happen to him, or is it something Erebus did, or is it a spell? <laughs> I love that. If I just peek at it a little bit? No, don't yell in the library. Don't mess with the librarian. Oh, yeah, penalty of death. Don't come back or we'll kill you. For realsy this time. <laughs> yeah, you ain't getting nothing. Lucky we don't strip you naked. Huh. That's the Dragon Prince symbol. I get the feeling we're gonna regret letting him live. It's not a bad thing to show mercy, but... I don't know. That one's... dangerous. Yep, there's Rap Tap tapping at the door. Of course, naturally she's sneaking around. Rogue's gonna rogue. You could just ask Caleb to help you. <laughs> they nailed it shut. <laughs> Seriously! Just tell the boy! He loves you, he will help you, unless you don't want his help. <laughs> the painting of the kid holding the sheep. <sighs> Seriously, just talk to the man. Did you really just pickpocket the boy? <sighs> sure enough. Hey, <laughs> hey, how's it going? Because the people here trust you! Stop betraying that trust! Gotta love how she can just portal stuff away. You gonna close that behind you, or...? Nope, just gonna leave it open, huh? Alright. Ah, uh, Claudia. You're getting real pissy. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, you actually remembered Ezrin's... Huh. How long has it been? That is a hell of an impeccable memory. Wait, did it stop halfway through? Ah, uh, the jail cell. Ew. Char of eyeballs. Char of toenails. Ugh. Do you even want to know what that is? Peanut butter. I don't know. Don't eat that! Oh, I guess it's good. Oh, another coin. Is it... Oh. Oh! Whoa! That was freaky. Well, I hope you don't regret breaking that jar. The weapons? Yeah. I mean, he's not dead. He's just coined? I don't know how to phrase that. Oh, oh. I mean... <laughs> 
is essentially yours now. Is this an actual thing or is this your mind playing tricks? Just ask them for help. I feel like she's being too, she's putting too much on herself. I get it. Everybody else is trying to focus on this great evil and all that. But I mean, look, I, I get that. Calum's research is important. Finding anything he can. But, I mean, I feel like he could multitask if he runs across anything involving how to free people from cursed coins, he'd probably tell you. Hell, for all you know, he already knows how to do that. Nope. Uh, <sighs> situation that could have been avoided had you just told Calum what you were doing. Ah, <sighs> Terry, love your positivity, but... <laughs> Little messenger dude was just like, I'm out this biz. Leaves? Aromatherapy. It's essentially potpourri. Like, Claudia, you being pissy isn't helping anything. Ooh, extremely smooth pebble. Ooh, that actually sounds kind of nice. A bag of extremely smooth pebbles? Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> it's essentially, um, bubble wrap. Ah, nice. Fuzzy friend. Whoa. Oh, he's so fluffy. Oh. Oh, that's so sweet. Why do I feel like Terry's gonna die at some point? Lost Secrets of Zadia, huh? Oh boy, really? Oh Jesus, oh boy. <sighs> like, you're allowed to get, like, ah, Rayla, why? Oh, the weapon that was used to kill the king. Oh boy, yeah. But it's a situation where she should have trusted you to say something. God, Rayla's tendency to put everything on herself is, like, it gets... It gets so annoying because like, look, Rayla, Rayla, <clears throat> it took so much just to get back into Caleb's good graces to even the slightest degree. <sighs> you better explain to this boy. You owe him that much. <laughs> so, yeah, I already kind of got out. <laughs> Is everything going to be fine? Okay, what's going on with the messenger? Uh, what did he say? What? You better explain. <sighs> Caleb, you're too nice. I'd be a lot pissed. It's like, dude. All you had to do was say something and I would just let you have it. <sighs> you are far too good to her. Scrolls of the First Elves, huh? Bookery of Luxoria. Oh. <laughs> oh, really? Go to Zadia. Uh, yeah. <sighs> he is far too kind. Okay, so, uh, what's this all about? Were they trying to summon what's his name? Wait, it's the name of this episode. Domino Profundus. Right, right, right. <sighs> A lot of these dragons haven't really had visitors in a hot minute. Oh, did the beacon fail or does that mean he's near? Okay, I'm gonna take it he's near. Ooh, sea dragon. I do love the majesty that they give to a lot of the dragons. Ooh. Up from the depths, 30 stories high, prehistoric, he spans in the sky. Godzilla, dun dun dun, Godzilla, bum ba dum. Ooh, domino profund. Ooh. Rude. Oh, lady. Oh, you don't know where the prison is. Oh, is it another riddle? Oh man, look at this shot. That is a shot. Ugh. I love the artistry of this series. Alright, what's the after credits thing? Who the heck is that guy? God, I know there's a lot of like extra stuff that I just haven't been able to look into and stuff. Like some story about Ezrin's new crown and stuff like that. I really should go back and look at all that. <laughs> Even the messenger is just like, it's so fluffy! Ah, uh, the map and the ring. I wonder, hmm, I don't trust Kareem. <laughs> and is that, is that Caleb reading in the bath? God, what a nerd. <laughs> Domina profundus. Right, so prevent, presented with another riddle. Don't know where it is, but I know what it is. Hmm, <sighs> what could it be, what could it be? I'm not smart enough for this kind of stuff. I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm average intelligence or below intelligence. So, might be good enough to make sure that nobody really finds it. I don't know. It, it, it does feel like one of those situations whereas in the more you seek to stop them, the more you make openings for them to find the prison so you know i would have gone with an approach of just waiting outside of the next waypoint to get to erevos and just stopping them there or at the very least posting guards or something then again erevos is a tricky one so hmm, hard to say let me know your thoughts on this episode in the comment section below like comment subscribe if you enjoyed the ride and until next time i've been news this then thanks so much for watching and i hope to see you later till then bye Bye.